Hey, good people, how you doing? David Taub here with Epic Guitar Instruction. Hope all is well, and I hope your guitar journeys are going famously. I've been getting a lot of emails from the good people, that's you, uh, that just want some easy songs to play, like some easy strummers, something you could just do sitting on the porch, one guitar, popular songs, something you have some fun with, right? So um, what I've done is uh, taken a song, stripped it down for one guitar, and we'll just play a very basic version of this song. It's super easy. It's Other Side from the Red Hot Chili Peppers 1999 release, Californication. It's just a handful of chords. I'll show you the strum patterns, just a couple different changes, and you could be playing this song fast, fun, and easy. No problem. But hey, um, if you can, do me a favor. If you have a second, please subscribe to, here it is over here, right? Subscribe to our YouTube channel. You know, that really helps us to keep bringing these lessons to you. And, and leave a comment below. Let us know what you want to hear, how you like the lesson. Click the thumbs up. Those things really help us to keep bringing you the content. Plus, if you hit subscribe, you'll know when we have new content up, right? All right, so the song is basically broken down to verses and choruses. There's a little bridge with guitar solo and whatnot. The song starts off with an intro, which is the same pretty much for the choruses. Um, and the chords are open chord A minor. I'll show you all the chords too. Those are over here also. It's backwards when I look at the monitor. Uh, a minor. To an F. To a C. And to a G. Right? That's it. That's pretty much the intro. And that's pretty much all the choruses. And then there's a verse section, which we'll get to. The neat thing about this is if you're just starting out on guitar, you could use the same strum pattern throughout the whole song. It makes it really easy. I'll just pick one. Obviously, there's a myriad of different ones that you want to try this with, but I'll just give you one to get you going. We'll do an easy pattern. It's an eighth note feel. Um, we'll do a down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, down, up. I'm holding the strings here just so we can grab a rhythm together, right? So two downs, down, down, two ups, up, up, and then a down, up. If you're having trouble with strum patterns, um, break them up into pieces, and that seems to really help. And then just practice going through them with no chords. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Play along with me. And if you fall off the horse, just get back on. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. If you like to count it out, one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Good. That's a pattern you could use with tons and tons of songs. Really easy, right? So let's take you through those changes. The, the only thing on this song that um, is a little different is that sometimes you'll be playing the, the chords one time through the pattern or one measure, and then there's a few times in the song where you'll be playing them two times through, two measures. Very easy. All right, so just A minor, F, C, G. So this is the intro and the choruses, the how long, how long, right? And it sounds like this. So that's the intro and all the choruses are the same. And then it goes into the verse sections, right? And the verse section, I heard your voice through the photograph, the first one, right? Um, all you're gonna do is you're gonna do the A minor to an E minor, back and forth. A minor, E minor, A minor, E minor, G, and then other side, but this time on that A minor, you play that twice. Uh, two times through this drum pattern. I'll play you the verse uh, right from the A minor. And it goes back into the centuries, it goes into uh, another verse, right? So technically you're doing the A minor a few times. 
But that's pretty much it, right? Those are the choruses and the verses. Um, the only variation is, there is one time when it goes, take it on, take it on. Uh, and that's when it gets to that, uh, take it on the other side of E minor. Then G, you stay on twice. A minor, twice. Right? Two times on the G, two times on the A minor. It's so easy. You could just sit there with your friends and just jam this out, right? Try singing it. You can capo it up if your voice it maybe lends to a higher range. Very easy song that you're playing fun and fast, right? And if you're having trouble with those chord changes and you can't seem to get them quick enough, click on that link below because I can really help you with that. I have a really awesome 30-minute lesson on all kinds of chord changing techniques and things that'll make your journey easier and exercises to really skyrocket your chord changing to the next level. I'll send it to you for free as well as an ebook where you can see a lot of these chords all diagrammed out, right? More lessons, more good stuff, and it's for free. So just click on that link below, send it to you for free. And then the bridge and guitar solo, you really probably won't be playing a guitar solo uh, if it's just you, right, playing one guitar, but I'll show it to you anyway. Uh, as far as what chords are going on underneath, it's just E minor for two measures. To C. And that's it. E minor to C. It's not like this. Same strong pattern. Let's take uh, what he's like, ter ter uh, turn me on, take me for a hard ride. And it goes right from there, right back into that A minor, F uh, to C to G. I'll just show you that transition. So I'll just play the E minor a couple times. To the C. We'll do one more time, right? Maybe downstrokes. If you want to build, like going into a change or build some anticipation, just doing all downs. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. That's it, man. That's all the changes. That's pretty much the whole song. Um, now, obviously, once you get that under your belt, you could try different kinds of strum patterns. You can go to my website, which is nextlevelguitar.com. There's over 2,000 lessons, by the way, beginners, intermediates, advanced, all levels, all genres of music. But you could learn all kinds of different devices and techniques that you could do with your strumming, uh, with your rhythm, um, with your lead playing. It's, it's, it's such a great site. In fact, there's a three-day free pass on the homepage. So just go to the homepage. We don't ask for a credit card or anything. Just three free days. Check it out. You might like it, you know. Um, but you could learn to do things like, for instance, you could do different strum patterns when you're jamming on that E minor to C. Shocking, I don't know. Arpeggiating. Right? So you um, we teach you all kinds of techniques on the site. And you'll learn a laundry list of different things you could do to dress up your playing because after a while you know you're going to want to embellish those chords or maybe play it a little bit differently just to break it up a little bit make it a little bit more musically interesting but that's it that's the whole song so try it with different strum patterns remember the only basic changes you're doing is whether you're on the the chords for one time through the strum pattern or one measure or two measures um and uh, have fun with that one remember click on that link below I'll send you a free ebook on chord changing. In fact, if you're having trouble with the strum pattern, I'll put another link down there. I'll send you an ebook and a video lesson that deals with strumming and how to, you know, kind of pick strum patterns apart and make your own and, and understand them rhythmically and start to play by ear more. Um, I'll put that video link in there also, as well as, you know, I'll put links to our Facebook page down there, the website. So check all that stuff out, right? And please subscribe to that channel. 
or, or subscribe to our channel. That really helps us. I'm David Taub with Epic Guitar Instruction. Um, really appreciate your support. Really appreciate you uh, checking out our videos. Peruse through many of our other lessons here. Uh, I try to break things up, do things for beginners, intermediates, advanced players, acoustic, electric. Um, just basically just have a lot of fun, right? You take care and keep on rocking.